They're simply the most expensive and sought after seats around. Concert tickets to see Taylor Swift at one of this weekend's three sold out shows in New Jersey. And if you remember last fall, when tickets went on sale, Ticketmaster's site crashed, leaving fans frozen out, forced to spend big bucks on the secondary ticket market. But now there are more ticket troubles and some parents, they're angry about it. Sit on your side, Dina Pineda is with the Swifties outside MetLife Stadium with more. Nina? Shade, if you were lucky enough to get tickets last fall, you maybe shelled out a couple of hundred bucks. Fans who thought they got really lucky on StubHub got heartbreaking news this week when the seller said, we're not sending your tickets. They say the site wasn't helping at all and they couldn't afford the new astronomical prices. One floor seat for tomorrow night's show going for up to 10 grand. <laughs> Seventh grader Rosie Shalom and her big sis Anna have kept a Taylor Swift countdown for months. I was wearing a white long skirt. They even made their dad his own bedazzled Swifty shirt to wear to the concert. <laughs> and he was even going to be willing to wear it. But with three days to go to the show, the South Orange family got bad news. So we apologize, but unfortunately your seller is not able to provide the tickets that you originally purchased. They had bought four tickets from the MetLife concert back in November for $1,800. Oh, we went on to step up and got tickets. But because it was a reputable site, we yeah. felt like we felt enough confidence that we gave it to them as their holiday gift. It was also a splurge Rosemary Burns can't shake off either. She spent $1,200 for two tickets, surprising her daughter and granddaughter for Christmas. I got an email from StubHub saying that the tickets were no longer available. StubHub's fan protect guarantee assures customers they could either get a full refund or comparable tickets. I think our seller sold tickets for about $300 each and then realized six months later that they could sell them for 10 times that. And sellers do face penalties and are not allowed to cancel a sale and then raise the price. They were deeply apologetic, but insisted there was absolutely nothing that they could do. This is not happening and I'm trying to process it. So we contacted the secondary marketplace giant, which investigated both transactions and within hours replaced Rosemary's Taylor tickets. I appreciate seven on your side because you do solve a lot of people's problems and it's really great that the community has you. And StubHub even came through with a surprise upgrade. No more nosebleeds for these Swifties. <laughs> and they're giving you the four on the 50 yard line. They went from having no tickets to having four tickets worth a total of $14,500. Well, StubHub apologized to both customers, acknowledging that it created confusion. Customers who get dissed by sellers are supposed to get either the same seats or better seats at no extra charge. So after we got involved, StubHub said it's going to update the website and also retrain their customer service reps so they can better communicate customer like right.